sure. Hotel is quite a few floors, maybe like six. Lobby, that's Indra. He's hurt his foot. But... We'll take him to a massage place to fix his foot. <laughs> I don't know what they're gonna do though. Lobby, elevator. No, there's no pool here. So. Okay, well here we are in the room uh, at the Fuji Hotel. This is the hotel where G Adventures Plus. Um, it's actually in a great location, uh, right off of main, one of the two or three or four main streets where they're just lined with shops and restaurants and uh, everything that you're going to need for your trip. So um, let's check it out. Here's the room. Double room in this case, uh, double beds, good size. Uh, our view, which you can't really tell, is of a, another building, but um, it's not that close. It's not a big deal. It's a nice armoire. There's no safe, not in our room anyway. If that matters to you guys, usually does these days. Nice little view of some buildings. And there's a little balcony, actually, I didn't notice that before. Uh, there is a TV, it's pretty small, but who cares? This is just part of a, usually a launching point for a bigger trip. Here is the bathroom. Modern toilet, western toilet. Um, sink, pretty, pretty basic. Um, but, in, you know, in good condition. I've, I've stayed in far worse places. Um, and, you know, G Adventures doesn't usually put you in top-notch places, but they usually put you in decent places. And this place is uh, nice and big and definitely happy with it. And, of course, there's air conditioning, which it's May, so it's kind of warm here. So um, I'm sure a lot of you guys can appreciate that. So that's the deal with this hotel. Um, uh, really easy to find. I think you guys will be happy here. For those of you wondering if you should book it a couple of days before the trip, your journey starts, uh, you could. I'm the type of guy that always likes to stay in a really nice place for a few days before the tour. Uh, but if you do book here in the lead-in up to the start date, your, your tour you'll be happier.